Hello and welcome to this short training on Money Point KYC. The purpose of this video is to show you the different levels we have in Money Point and how much you can transfer and withdraw depending on your KYC level. We have five KYC levels in Money Point and in each of the levels there is a maximum amount you can transfer and maximum amount you can withdraw once and the total you can also withdraw or transfer in a day so here is a table showing you different levels then the amount you can transfer once single transfer and single withdrawal and the requirements you need to be in each of the levels the first one is level one if you are in level one you can transfer a maximum of 50,000 naira once and you can withdraw a maximum of 50,000 naira once the requirements here are your personal details and some business details once you have money points account you will be automatically placed on level one once you open an account you'll be placed on level one so you don't need to do anything again once you have money points account because before you create the account you would have supplied all the details needed to be in level one so once you have if you see yourself in level one it means that the maximum amount you can transfer once is 50,000 naira, and the maximum amount you can withdraw once is also 50,000 naira. So if you are a PS agent and someone wants to transfer more than 50,000 naira from your from your business center it cannot go through if you are in level 1 and if the person wants to withdraw more than 50,000 naira once it cannot go through if you are in level 1 now for you to upgrade to level 2 if you are in level two, you can withdraw a maximum of 100,000 naira once and transfer a maximum of 100,000 naira once. And for you to upgrade to this level two, you will need to link your NIN to your Money Points account and also provide your nest of kin details. Your nest of kin details. Here you supply the person's name, the phone number the address and some other things needed to know about your nest of king and for you to upgrade you will see when you open your money points app if you look on top of the page you will see your kyc level when you click on it you will see upgrade now and when you click on that upgrade now then the system will tell you the next thing to supply will give you the the place to supply your name your NIN uh, number, then you link it and then provide your nest of kin information. Once you are done with that and it is reviewed and accepted, you will be, you will be uh, placed on level two. Now, we have level three. If you are in level three, you can transfer a maximum of a maximum of one five million naira once and you don't have any limit you can withdraw in a day or i mean you can withdraw once so any person can withdraw any amount once and you can transfer up to five million naira once if you're in level three so one of the things you have to do is to make sure that you are at least in level three if you are a money point business owner you must get to this level three so that when customers come to your business center they won't have any issue trying to withdraw money and also transferring large amounts so this is basic you must provide the information needed to get to level three for you to get to level three all you need to do is to provide your um, proof of address which includes your nepa bill so you show something that will prove your address 
basically your NEPA bill, once you upload it and it is reviewed and accepted, you'll be placed on level 3. And that means that you can transfer up to 5 million at once and you, there's no limit on the amount that a customer can withdraw from your business center. So to remove any restriction in the withdrawal amount, you make sure that you get to level 3. Now, for level 4, you can transfer up to 10 million naira, and just like level 3, you don't have any limit that somebody can withdraw from you. So unlimited withdrawal and 10 million naira transfer once. Now, for you to get to level 4, you upgrade by providing your CAC certificates and show other business details which include where you operate, where your business is, and few other information needed to know about your business. Then the basic document to upload is your CAC certificate. Now, one thing about, or one important thing about upgrading to level four is that upgrading to level four will help you to retain a business name. So if you want to, if you want your business name to be appearing in your account, you must upgrade the account to at least level 4. If you don't upgrade to level 4, it means that your account will be bearing your personal name. But if you have a business and you want your account to be bearing the business name like ABC Global Limited, this is a business name, you must upgrade the account to level 4 before it can bear that business name. And it is the name on your CAC certificate that will be showing on your account. So you have to be careful when registering your CAC certificate. That same name that you want to appear to see in your account is what you are going to use to register your CAC. So once you upload your CAC and provide the necessary information, the necessary details about your business, you'll be placed on level four. And then you can transfer up to 10 million naira once and have unlimited withdrawals. Now, for level 5, you can transfer up to 100 million naira once. A single transfer of 100 million naira. And of course, there is no limit to the number or to the amount you can withdraw once. And all you need here is basically a summary of all you have done before. So you just provide a supporting document about your business if there is any, or summarize the details provided before. And then you'll be upgraded to level 5. So once you get to level 4, it will be very, very easy for you to upgrade to level 5. So once you get to this level 5, your business will have your business name, just like level 4. It will have your business name, and you can transfer up to 100 million naira once. So this is, uh, this is all about money point KYC levels. So here you now know your levels and what you can do at each level. Thanks for watching. Please remember to subscribe to this YouTube channel and come back for more.